First at six tonight, two pedestrians are dead following a pair of accidents along Central Avenue overnight. Hi, good evening and thanks for being with us. I'm Shay Arthur. That first one happened near the University of Memphis and the other in Midtown near Simmons Bank Liberty Stadium. Our Shay Simon is live now at MPD's Crump Station with what we know. Hey Shay. Yes, a Memphis police are calling one of these incidents the one at Central and Hollywood, a deadly hit and run. Police tell us just around one o'clock this morning, a person was found dead and the driver took off. And right now, police are still looking for them. Now, for perspective, Central and Hollywood is less than half a mile from the Simmons Bank Liberty Stadium. And we went back this afternoon. The Tigers game was wrapping up and we talked to tailgaters about how pedestrian friendly the area is. I think you got to help, like, um, put some more sidewalks in and have more lighting just for people to walk around so people who's driving can actually see what's going on. I'm excited about all the things they've done with Tiger Lane in the years since I've been here back in the early 80s. So, uh, yeah, I think it's walkable. Now that other incident happened at Central and Zach Curlin that is near the University of Memphis and in that incident we do know that the driver stayed on the scene but Shay we reached out to MPD tonight to find out just how many hit and runs we've seen here across the city so of course we will have much more on that tonight at 10 live in downtown Memphis Shay Simon WREG News Channel 3. All right.